Hi, dear Janis. So, you are one of the photographers from our Hanoi Photo Club and quite an extinguished one. And as you are, because I'm leaving, taking over the administration of the club in a way. So, <laughs> I want to know something. How long are you doing photography and what brought you to photography? Well, I'm uh, uh, taking photographs since my childhood, actually where I already had a Canon AE-1. This was one of the my first big Christmas gift for my parents. And I immediately discovered that uh, this is a, an activity which I should uh, expand. But at that time, uh, you could only print the pictures uh, and not develop them uh, online or by, by any computer device. So therefore, photography was at that time unforgiving uh, in terms of mistakes. Uh, and uh, I took a break for a while, and then uh, when uh, digital photography came up uh, 20 years ago, I restarted again until uh, and tried to develop further. So, as we have seen a lot of good of your pictures in the photo club as well, what is your main subject? What are you taking the images most of? Well, the, um, as you can see, most sh uh, subjects cover uh, street photography. Uh, and uh, landscape, but uh, also coincidental snapshots on the street where I sometimes uh, stand for a while and where I can b predict a certain situation worth to be taken uh, in, a, in a photograph. And uh, of course, I have to challenge uh, my luck also in order to get uh, good pictures. So you have to give a lot of tries until you find the one great shot. Okay, we had one shot of you meant, uh, featured in the photo club. This is from a guy in the evening behind a window, CMC is painting. Can you tell us about how, how did you take it, what was your thought and what has been your attention? Well, I uh, was walking through the uh, streets uh, of uh, a suburb in Hanoi, which uh, where uh, life in the in the houses is uh, very transparent uh, from the street so this is a kind of typical feature of uh, hanoi that uh, you have a very dense uh, architectural structure in in some suburbs and you can see a lot of uh, sceneries from daily life and this is actually what i'm interested in to capture uh, the lives of uh, people in uh, in and outside their homes and uh, to cover their lives inside their homes the best time to, to do that is uh, of course in the night and there you can see that uh, it's a kind of uh, interesting activity in the night so nobody would expect somebody to paint uh, a window uh, cover uh, in the night so uh, I wanted to have a surprise momentum also in this regard. Yeah, that was very well taken. Uh, do you have any ideas for any projects in the coming futures? Well, there are uh, plenty of them, uh, which uh, one could do. Uh, a lot of things. I mean, I'm three years already here in Hanoi, and uh, uh, and, and uh, within the group, I uh, covered a lot of uh, features and a lot of uh, topics. Um, one of uh, them could be, for example, to um, Combine plane spotting uh, with uh, life uh, in the rural area near the airport to uh, highlight the contrast between modern and uh, traditional life. Uh, model photography uh, or photography in uh, bars uh, could also be an interesting topic, but also sports photography. There's a, a lot of sports activities here in Hanoi, like uh, boxing uh, or anything else, and that, that could be also in another area. Well, thank you very much, and we are waiting for the things you are coming up with and to show us our limits. Okay, thank you.